Okay, good day everyone. Today we learn about chapter 1.2 number system and representation. At end of this topic, students should be able to explain how data is represented in a computer. Our data, our computer represent data. Computers are digital. Recognize only two discrete states on and off. Because computers are electronic devices powered by electricity, which also has two states, bits and bytes. The two digits 0 and 1 represent these two states on off. Digit 0 represent off, absence of an electronic charge. Meanwhile, digit 1 represent 1, presence of an electronic charge. The computer recognizes only two states, 1 and 0, called binary system. Bits. Binary system is a number system that has two unique digits, 0 and 1, called bits. Bit, short for binary digit, is the smallest unit of data the computer can process. Bytes. When 8 bits are grouped together as a unit, they form a byte. Example, 11010011. A byte provides different combination of zeros and ones to represent 256 different character. 2 power of 8 equals to 256. Okay, why 2? Because binary, 0 and 1. Why 8? Because got 8 light should be bulk on or off. Okay, characters include numbers, letters, punctuation marks and symbols. Includes audio, graphic, video, text and numbers. Example, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 1 represent letter E. Okay, 8 bit byte for number 4. 8 bit byte for number 6, 8 bit byte for letter E. So, we took the example of letter E. Okay, letter E if 0, 1, 0 in ASCII, American Standard for Code Interchange, they will be stored as a capital letter. In the 5 uh, states after that, 0, 0, 1, 0, 1 is represent the position of letter E. Okay. This define how the letter E is represented in the computer. Number system and representation. Now we focus on the difference between bit and byte in terms of size and usage. Okay, in terms of size, bit is the smallest unit of data computer can process that consists of 0 and 1. Meanwhile, byte 8 bits group together as a unit to store a single character up to 256 individual characters. Usage used to measure data transfer rate of a computer communication device is for big. Okay, this one is used to measure the data transfer rate for bit. Meanwhile, for byte, you have to use to measure the storage capacity such as kilobyte, megabyte, terabyte, and petabyte. Okay. We took one example, hexadecimal numbers. What is hexadecimal numbers? Okay, hexadecimal number is consists of 16 digits. Just now we learn about binary. Binary consists of two electronic states, 0 and 1, which co group together in 8. So, we can get a 1 byte. Meanwhile, what is hexadecimal? Hexadecimal also represent digits is from 0 to 9 and A to F. Alphabet A to F actually is represent decimal numbers from 10 to 15. 0 to 9, we use uh, normal numbers and 10, we try to use, we will use A to represent 10 until F we use, uh, actually we use for 15. Base of this number system is 16. Hexadecimal number is actually translated into binary for computer use uh, later. Why we need hexadecimal number? We know we already have binary numbers. Hexadecimal is very useful for color representation and assemble key language program used to error messages and is more 
uh, if compare more storage compared to normal binary uh, digits. Eh? Example of uh, hexadecimal numbers B75, A, B16, and uh, Aztec FF0000 is to represent colors. So, I think that is all for today. So, have a nice day. Thank you, class.